continuing on with the Norwegian crag rebuild. I'm starting on the cleaning rod and I'm just going to drill a hole on the end here. So the end of this cleaning rod is a little unique looking. It's a, a knurl, but only like half of a knurl. So it's sort of like a spiral or like a, a really high pitched thread. So how I'm going to cut that here is I have this uh, bump knurling tool and I'm just going to bump it off of one of these wheels. This one right here being the closest, closest match I could find to the, the sort of pitch and look it is. Now, it's always really tough to knurl at such a small diameter, especially on a bump knurler and a small lathe like this, because it's just going to flex. So I'm going to do the best I can here, run it low with oil and see how it cuts. So that's the result there. I'm not sure how well that's showing up on camera, but you can see why I wanted to drill that hole before knurling it. It's, uh, it might have double fed the knurl, but I think it looks okay.
So you're probably wondering why I'm making a cleaning rod that's only about two inches long. And the answer is simply, that's all it needs to be. So the cleaning rod is approximately ends flush with the muzzle, which is only about a half inch from the end of the stock here. So if I'm trying to replicate the look of the gun, I really only need it sticking out about that far. Now they originally had about like a nine inch cleaning rod and I had made this on the lathe it has the same end. You can see on this one I learned to drill the hole first before knurling it. But to get this cleaning rod into the stock here I'd have to bore a hole, a straight hole, just about that deep. And even with a long drill bit that's pretty difficult. The, Stock here is pretty thin. I don't want to blow out either up or down or side to side. So my idea was to just make a really, really short cleaning rod that basically just sticks out the end there. This little nut is a retaining nut. Just goes down into this square slot right here. And it screws in just like, just like that. dropping the action in the stock there. You can see the cleaning rod's just about flush with the muzzle. I can screw it a little bit out, a little bit in. I've seen reference pictures that kind of all over the place, but it's pretty much flush with the muzzle more often than not.